Astronomers just discovered that something we thought was constant about black holes has actually been changing for billions of years. Here is what happened and why it matters. On December 27, 2025, an international team led by Maria Chira reported that the long-trusted relationship between the ultraviolet and X-ray light from quasars is not fixed across cosmic time. For decades, scientists assumed this link was universal, letting them use quasars, hyperbright disks around supermassive black holes, as standard candles to probe the expansion of the universe. By combining new Erosita X-ray data with ESA's XMM-Newton and more than 130,000 quasars from the Sloan Digital Sky Survey, the team found that distant early universe quasars follow a subtly different pattern than nearby ones. That suggests the hot corona of gas around black holes, and the way energy flows from the accretion disk into that corona has evolved as galaxies aged and environments changed. Using sophisticated Bayesian statistics, the researchers showed the relation becomes a bit flatter and less scattered at higher redshifts, a signal strong enough that cosmological studies now have to take it seriously. If we ignore this evolution, measurements of dark energy and the universe's expansion history based on quasars could be biased. Future X-ray missions will test whether the trend holds for even fainter, more distant quasars, and help recalibrate them as cosmic yardsticks. To me, this result is a healthy reminder that nature rarely hands us perfect standard objects. Even the brightest beacons in the universe turn out to have a history we must respect when we use them to measure everything else.